Okay, got it back here today. And Miss Grace from Diamond Place with Grace. You the reason I got this. Not complaining. I took it out of the outer package already. Trying to make it easier. Didn't know the bubble wrap was going to be so hard to get into. Oh, Lord. Yeah. So, um, but I ordered this one from Uniquely Yours, um, due to your recommendation. Oh. We didn't have the one that I actually wanted, but they had this one, and it just spoke to me, so I went ahead, and I got it. Oh, let me tell you what, it went on a trip. Um, it's taken me about a month to get it. The worst part is, it didn't take long for it to come over here to the U.S., but it sure took it forever to get its trip around the states. Now this is a bit of an odd one. If anybody has watched my Instagram and some of my videos, you will see that I've not done anything like this. And this is a 60 by 75. It will be my largest um, to date. I'm not going to be in any big hurry to get it done either because it is so large and I hope, I hope you guys can see this. It is called, okay, you have to bear with me so I can try and get it in there, through the eyes of a child. So you can back you up. Well, no, bring you this way. I'm sorry for the movement, you guys, but it's called through the eyes of a child and it shows up little one there with different things. I don't know how well you all can see it. Uh, with just different things all around the child. Um, it is poured glue. Ooh, it's sticky. don't know, see how well you can see that, but it is poured glue. Um, see if I can move it up here to you. You can see the symbols really well um, on it. It has your ledger, your schematic, whatever you want to call it. Oh, here we go. Let me take the plastic off of that. I can show it to you here. I forget about that. There you go. That's what it looks like. I'm a little shaky, you guys. I'm sorry. But that's what it looks like. Um, and it has this schematic upper right here. Has it on the lower left here, as you can see. Um, I just, I don't know. I can't remember which one Grace did. But she was doing one. And I also oh, wanted to do, uh, that's the one I was looking for. Because that's the one I wanted. But, um, I couldn't find it. So I just went looking through the shop just to see what I could, and this was what I found. And like I said, I absolutely love it. Now, let's see what it came with. We got our, oh, okay, two trays, a thing of wax, and rounded tweezers. I don't think I, well, if I can figure out how to get into it, it's right there. I just can't get my fingers working this morning. Um, pull it out. Okay, there we go. It usually comes with, okay, here we go. Oh, not too pointy, but nice. Um, I can't remember if this is round or square. These are round. That's why. The tweezers like that. Two trays and a big hunk of uh, your wax. And, ooh, okay, they sent me a nice pen, my first. I don't have one like 
I don't have one of these. I've been just using what come with the kit. Oh, wow. Different placers. Oh, this has got one, the angled one I've heard everybody talk about, too. Here we go. Okay, here we go. I'll have to try that. I haven't done that, but it comes with this beautiful, beautiful orange pen. And I love orange, and it has a single placer on it. Uh, that looks like a three placer, maybe a six. And I think this is an 11 placer. So those come with it. Um, set those aside. Let's take a gander at the drills. And like I said, um, Grace with Diamonds is the one that she lives in Australia. So this is a Australian company. Um, I didn't, uh, I think shipping and everything through this, and like I said, it's a larger size. Um, it's a 60 by 75. This is the largest one I've gotten today. I think even with the shipping, it was less than $50. So, uh, let me show you a picture again of it. There we go. That's what it looks like right there. And I just thought it was beautiful. Um, bags, uh, they look like they have, these are done by weight. Ooh, and I have the window open. Oh, wow, these are some gorgeous diamonds. I don't know how well you guys can see those, but it's got the DMC on it. Um, but they're individually done. I do believe that's the DMC number. Uh, wow, honestly, it doesn't tell me. So this is the number 37. Seven, six. Yeah, this is this would be the DMC number. Um, oh, wait a minute. No. I don't believe this. Look at these purples. I know you guys love purples. Maybe if I sit down, we could have a little more light. Sorry for the noise, you guys. There we go. There's a little more light. Maybe you can see the sparkle in them. That's a nice purple. Um, this is got a, this one's kind of crazy probably. Oh my, here's one of the main colors. It, I'm not sure how it's going to come across on camera, but it is actually a burgundy. So I'm guessing because the bag is so large, um, that's going to be one of the main colors. This looks 3371. I want to say that's a black, but it looks brown, but I'm not positive. I think it's brown. I mean, not black. So those are, I'm sure, along with, whoops, that's the wrong one. Along with this one. Okay, now here's the black. So let's, let me look. Yeah, that bigger bag was, this one here, is more your um, browns. Here's 310. Not, not too bad, but my biggest bag to date. Um, I've had quite a few that haven't had any 310s in it. Uh-oh, got one trying to escape out of this one, so hold on. It's just above the zipper. We don't want to lose any diamonds. I'll have to look through the rest. Oh, wait a minute. Wow, there are some huge ones. There's some more in this. Bags. Wow. Okay, here's a red, I'm going to call it a cranberry. I'm hoping it comes across on there, you guys. I'm sorry if it don't. I'm trying. And then this is what, maybe a burnt orange or more like some of your bricks. Um, colors as well. It's 919. 
Uh, let's see, there are more large bags. <laughs> uh, no. Okay, that's it. But I will. We'll just dump them. Why not? It's not like they're in any order. Maybe you guys can get a good look at that. But um, doesn't look to be any trash. And when I sit over here in the light from my window, I mean, they look. These diamonds, oh my God, let me tell you guys, I mean, I hope and pray y'all can see the shine. I mean, these, and I'm not really seeing what you would call trash either in the bags. Look at this beautiful, beautiful peach. And I'm trying to sit so you can see, hopefully, the shine off of them. Because they're gorgeous. And, I mean, let's set these back here. It really is. Let me show you the picture one more time. I cannot wait. I'm doing the... Um, Snack with friends with Urelli and Jenny this month, so we can't do anything larger than a 40 by 50. So uh, I'm going to get most of those done, and then depending on the size of two other diamond paintings that I have, because I honestly cannot remember what size they are. Um, before I start on this. Uh, but I may end up moving prior to starting this. So uh, I really hope you guys enjoy this because it has been a fun. I just, you know, like I said, it took a trip around the States. It's the only reason it took forever to get here. It's been sitting in Georgia up until probably last night for almost two weeks for some reason. So, I will let you know when I start in on it. Um, I'm saying it's blue diamonds, I'm sorry. And if y'all like this video, please hit the like button. Uh, subscribe. If you're not already, I, am, I deal with depression. Um, so, I'm trying to get better at putting videos up, especially with these, because they seem to be helping. So, I would love to have you part of our Blue Diamonds family. Um, if you're already a member, thank you for stopping in and watching the video. Um, you know, like I said, I do diamond painting, I do planners, um, and just several different crafts, crochet, you name it, I have junk journals, just different things. So I'm trying to get into all of that again. So, uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and we will catch you next time. Bye.